Hi, today I'm reviewing Out of the Fog from 1941. Uh, I saw this on uh, TCM Noir Alley and Eddie Muller called it a proto-film noir, I believe. And yeah, that, that description does seem to fit. Um, it's not quite film noir yet, but it's definitely getting into that territory. And it, it is actually kind of a film noir. But um, really, more it's more like a gangster movie that's creeping into film noir territory. Um, I thought it was okay as a movie. I thought it's kind of slow moving in, in some ways and kind of corny in some ways. But um, I think the thing that really got me about this movie was watching John Garfield, who I normally think of as a sympathetic character, uh, be such a mean guy. I mean, he plays this gangster who's extorting these fishermen and it's really kind of revolting and, and you just want to kill him. But um, anyway, he gets involved with Ida Lupino, and yet that's the other thing that really got me about this movie. Ida Lupino playing such a dish rag. <laughs> I just wanted to say, wake up, girl. But then again, I could completely understand where she was coming from. She's like, I don't want to live my life as a fishwife, you know, on this wharf all the time. and. So, you know, you can kind of see the, all the Depression era roots in this movie. It's based on a play called The Gentle People. And the gentle people are the people in the boats who are being extorted, of course. And the whole thing is about exploitation of people in this position and how the, the, the powerful exert control over the weak and the, the not-so-powerful and and um, so for that, I mean, it's worth watching. I mean, especially for cineasts. I mean, true cineasts. This one is worth watching, I suppose. And um, because it, it really gives you a, flair, a flavor for, for that whole historical, all that, that time there, you know. The, the films that came out of the Depression are interesting. I mean, that, I could probably do a whole series on that, on, on, on the fact that there were so many, like, really upbeat, yeah, 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 movies during the Depression to counteract all that depression. And, you know, also at the same time, you had this gangster stuff coming up and, you know, real dark stuff. So this is a really interesting movie as a kind of an in-between between that period and the solid film noir period of the 40s and 50s. Um, and as for the um, actors, I mean, I, I, I love them all. I mean, I love Ida Lupino. I love John Garfield. Eddie Albert uh, was in the unenviable position of playing the the normal nice guy who, um, of course, always looks so dull and boring compared to, you know, the bad guy, <laughs> I guess. Um, as you see in Out of the Past, for instance, now there's a film noir. <laughs> anyway, how'd I get on that subject? I don't know. Um, but it was, it's, it's a good film, um, one that I would recommend for cineasts, particularly, because of the whole historical context, really. Um, and there's a lot of history that goes into the make, as far as like what could and couldn't go into this film, because there were definite changes from the end of the play that had to be made because of, you know, the Hayes Code and all of that. Anyway, that's it for me, and I'll talk to you later. Thanks.